<laughs> it's the best smoothie I've ever had. It's so good. I love smoothies. One thing I'm really liking about Antigua so far is that it's obviously a tourist destination. They have hotels and everything. They're selling things to tourists. But it's also still a place where people live and work. And there's definitely a, opportunities to see like the realities of different cultures and the way people live. And I'm really enjoying both of those. Chelsea's just snacking on her smoothie. Sorry. <laughs> I really like it because everyone speaks to you in Spanish, even though you're obviously an American. They're still trying to keep their culture alive, and that's really great. There's a bug on you. Me? Oh. Also, lots of students keep coming up to us and asking if they can practice their English, which is really sweet. Mm -hmm. Makes me a little nervous. We had these people come up to us that were wearing shirts that said, I love England, and asked us if we were British, and they were really disappointed that we weren't. Sorry. <laughs> Maybe next time we should pretend. Mm. <laughs> we're doing that. <laughs> so we were just sitting um, in this bookstore and I wanted to throw away my smoothie cup and I asked the woman, I handed it to her and I said buscar, which I'm pretty sure means scoop time. <laughs> and she goes busea, which is to take out the trash. Or basura, yeah, trash. And I said, so basically I handed her a cup and said scoop it up. <laughs> she was like, what? <laughs> Oops. So this is the crew. We're hiking up the volcano. We got some horses, some people. We got a doctor. <laughs> I can get yeah. There's also a lot of horse poop. Yeah. Caca de los caballos. Pacaya uno. Ahora pacaya estos. Colapso. Ahora arriba no hay actividad de lava. Hace cuatro meses para acá ya activo. Ahora para acá ya es tranquilo, ¿sí? Ahora arriba es muy caliente para posible cocinar marshmallows. ¿Alguien del grupo lleva marshmallows? No. ¿O comerlo? ¿Sí? No. ¿Sí los comen? No. ¿Está bien? I'm leading the pack now. <laughs> Everyone is doomed. <laughs> you kidding? I was saying we're having a great time. I mean, I'm in charge of direction, so Julia's look a out. Guide. Obviously. <laughs> Way to go, Julia. She's leading us. I can say like the derecha, which is right. I'm pointing to the left. So that's wrong. <laughs> Izquierda, derecha. I got it. Pero es muy Acá es suave, posible para. She's saying it smells oh. like cheese. Oh, I don't smell cheese. I don't smell any cheese. Cheese? For medicina natural. Medicine. Natural mm. medicine. What does it do? Take your shirt off. I don't know. I'm not supposed to wipe it on my face. Para qué? Es la hoja de queso. Para el calor. What did that say? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, possible. And then, that's like it smells like cheese. No, it doesn't. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my goodness. On the lava, acá es lava de cuatro meses. Acá colapsó el 2 de marzo, ¿sí? La parte acá. 
ya, de personas a poco es final posible para cocinar los marshmallows ah ok cool So the guy told us that this lava here is from four months ago or four months? Four months ago. Four months ago. And those people down there, it's so hot down there, you can roast marshmallows. Hey, that's a volcano! I feel like we're walking to the end of the earth. Uh, welcome to the only shop you'll find next to an active volcano. But this was actually an inspiration that came from one of the biggest eruptions in the history of the volcano Pacaya in 2010. And what a group of artisans decided to do, instead of asking for money, they were able to create beautiful art. So please take a look, it's not something that you're going to see at the airport or at your regular marketplace, to say the least. Okay, so we are at the base of a volcano at a volcano store, at a lava store, I'm sorry. And all <laughs> How dare you? here, I know. And all things here are made from, location. and it's new location since 2010 when it last erupted. And everything here is made from the lava of the volcano. And I just bought it. The first time I'm ever holding out my hand to show something. I know, around. I know. <laughs> So we just got back from our volcano hike. It was such a good experience. The whole thing was like 10 US dollars and they picked us up from our hotel and took us there. It was like an hour and a half drive, a guided tour, um, and then they took us all the way back and we met some really cool people. There was a group of girls that were um, doing a professional development teaching program. There was a girl that was a doctor and she does um, pediatric cataract surgery. She was just here doing some surgery. So it was really cool people and a nice couple. Um, but now we're gonna go eat because we're starving and then we're gonna go to sleep because tomorrow we're getting picked up by a bus at 4 a.m. and we're going to the Mayan ruins of Copan. So I'll see you guys later. Bye y'all. This is Honduras. 